Not enough nonsense in your life. Need a little more. More? Well, get ready, because these two have it in spades. Yeah, the two Loose talk. What are you talking about? Nonsense. Even looser opinions. Please explain. And you're along for the ride. Everybody strap in. This is The Burble with Benny and Az. Welcome along to another Burble. My name is Benny. My name is Az. That was a little bit delayed because uh, we're currently on lockdown. So we've gone yeah. out, we spent some money, we did some telecommunication stuff, all that kind of thing. There was a lot of we're swearing. In the internet. There was a lot of swearing on Az's side of things. Yes, uh, there was. Getting this thing yeah. set. Yeah. What was the main lesson in getting this remote um, thing set up as? Don't buy cheap shit from China. Yep, that's right. Don't buy yep. your broadcast stuff from Wish and you'll be fine. Now, mm. we, we I've just received word... Uh, through the verbal supercomputer ads, okay, that yep. apparently we're in this state until September 10. So, uh, Indeed we are. Yeah, locked down until September 10, which is a bit shit. Luckily, I'm stuck here with Candy. Yeah, I was going to say, hello, Candy. Welcome to the show. Now, what we're also doing as well is we're using Zoom so we can actually see each other because it's just a little bit difficult doing a podcast where you can't actually see your guests. So, um, yeah, it is hard. Yeah, it is very, very hard. So, uh, you know what? You brought a story about... Uh, a woman who earns money in mean, a much easier way than, than Candy there behind you. Mm. And what we're doing as well. Yeah, the, we we, we gi- should be millionaires. We're giving away what this chick does, basically, is, uh, well, I'm not going to reveal it, but it's something no. that as an I give away. It, it's something that's more prevalent and awful when we're camping, if you want to... <laughs> Put it in that context. Um, and that's coming up. Also as well, now speaking of earning an, a, a wage like she's doing there and the other woman, uh, Renee Gracie. Remember Renee Gracie? Indeed I do. You remember no, Renee Gracie? She was uh, in the second tier of the V8 supercars and then she was one of the supergirls, I guess, uh, and raced with mm-hmm. Simona Di Salvestro and the Harvey Norman Nissan and binned it in the wall. Now, <laughs> she reckons that... Because OnlyFans is now coming to an end with the nudity. I think it's October, isn't it, As? Well, no, they've they've backflipped. We should talk about that, too. Okay, all right. Well, she wants to get into uh, racing again. She wants to race at Bathurst again. Uh, so we'll see whether or not that, that's going to happen. Um, did you see what happened with the Wiggles, As? Oh, there was some controversy. Didn't they get more Wiggles? There's now more Wiggles. There's now twice as many Wiggles than there were originally, and they're all going to be on this uh, on the stage doing all that kind of thing. Apparently, it's all inclusive, but we'll talk about that. So it doesn't matter mm. what background you come from, uh, you can be uh, a bloody Wiggle, okay? Uh, that's uh, had a few now. Like The original Cockroaches, are, or the, the band, the Cockroaches, yes. that started the Wiggles, Like they're all pretty much dead or in a retirement home now, aren't they? That's right. Um, Also, the Therapeutic Goods Administration is warning against self-medicating COVID-19 with a drug which they use on livestock as Mm, ivermectin. ivermectin. What's the story there? Now, apparently it's shown some promise in killing virus particles. It's like... Trump injecting bleach. Bleach will kill virus particles too, but it'll kill you. Yeah, it will. Hey, uh, more that and more coming up on The Burble, so stick around. This is The Burble with Benny and Az. Podcasting's a hard gig. Oh, it is. Nine to five's a hard gig. No, yeah, it's even worse. I, I'd probably, I'd like to be podcasting all the time, but not, not enough. enough people have smashed on the subscribe button there to make us that no. popular as of yet, That's which it. I'm disappointed in. But anyway. So we're still on the nine to five. Yes. Um, selling our used underwear didn't really take off. Yeah, see, um, look, no. Yeah. Look, I went through that just before we discussed the the, the, the undie sniffing kind of deal on the last mm. podcast. Um, I had an undie cull. Now, men are notoriously bad at the undie cull, where I have it from my fiancé that apparently you're supposed to get rid of your underwear every three months. Really? Yeah, well, that's what she said, and I went, hang on a minute. No, and but the stuff that I got rid of, I had for ages, like yeah, forever. Like you only get rid of it when the holes in it are big enough to put a leg through. Yeah. I've got underwear that's seen, you know, seven or eight prime ministers at this <laughs> point. Um, although that's not saying much. Although no. we've been pretty stable lately. We have. Um, but look, what I was getting at is earning a crust is hard. You really got to push yourself and work nine to five. Winning the lotto is never really an option. No. We're not built like candy. No. So that's not going to work. There's a chickie on the internet that we've discovered, and 
Her name's Lush Botanist. Now, you might think she, you know, does flower arranging or something like that. Oh, yeah. But no. Yeah, her, no, I wonder no. what her bouquet is like. Oh, her bouquet. Um, well, she tells you about her bouquet. Well, um, but, uh, we've got some audio. We do have some audio, so let's cut to that right now. All right. Um, that one's what we call an earthquake. My farts have made me over $25,000, and what? here's how I did it. <laughs> Wait, what? What? <laughs> 25 grand. 25 She's farts, bro. 25,000 US dollars. Yeah. Cheebers. All right, okay. But you needed some farts. Uh, the most I've earned in one month is close to $4,000. Ooh, I have special items that I offer <laughs> go like back, a fart go back, go back. My farts in a. <laughs> Wait, what? 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 What am I going back for? <laughs> Four grand in a month. Four and grand. then she was like, ooh, she made farts. Try to be sexy. See, there's someone out there for everyone, isn't there? Farts are not sexy. I know that because well, I do them. And, and like, the, yeah. my fiance has to buy special candles for the house to uh, <laughs> get rid of We've my peeling bouquet. paint. Well, I can kill like, crops. Um, mm. Like, there's no. Do you want know during the mouse plague? None came around here. I'll give it <laughs> on. Just on drop that. one, and then you know, no mice. No. Nah, uh, can I restart nah. this again? Please, please. That one's what we call an earthquake. My farts have made me over twenty-five thousand dollars, and here's how I did it. I heard you needed some farts. Uh, the most I've earned in one month is close to four thousand dollars. Ooh, I have special items that I offer, like a fart lollipop. My farts in a jar. I'm going all out this morning, so these farts are gonna be crazy. I am the fart queen <laughs> of the internet. Parmesan makes my farts smell extra sulfury, but mozzarella gives me those big bubbly farts. I am lactose intolerant, so that gets my guts rumbling. Um, <laughs> where did you find? The, where did you find the this shit? Content I, on the internet. Um, look, it was uh, in one of my uh, news feeds that came up, and um, I was just like, "Ooh, woman sells farts." I'm like, "This will be a boring think piece or some crap." Sure. And, Nah, went straight into that video, and I knew I knew we had to. I just realised I wasn't recording this uh, video oh. stuff, but anyway. Um, oh, hang on, that's that's Candy, everyone. Hi, Candy. <laughs> hi, Candy. Uh, she goes on as. I have been doing this business for three years. My first fart video was somebody contacted me and said, I want you to fart for me on camera. And so I did. And that to this day is still one of my best selling fart videos. Do you reckon, do you reckon he gets, <laughs> do you reckon he gets foundation stock in like her little fart business? Do you know what I mean? Like he's the founding member. He, he's the one that, you know, gave her the idea. Like He got a jar of farts with a gold label on it. Yeah, yeah, exactly the right. First fart yeah. ever farted. Like on YouTube, you know what I mean? Like YouTubers yeah, have their- button. Gold, got the old play She's button. She's got a gold sphincter. I kept getting requests over and over. Thank you to my client for sponsoring this fart lunch. I thought, you know what? People will pay me for this and I'm going to do it. I'm telling you, cheese really does it. I can feel it in my guts already. Cheers. Now, what mm. we're seeing at the moment is a, um, a neck beard by the name of Jonathan, who is her partner. <laughs> now, Jonathan looks like he's reluctantly appearing in this video. <laughs> I've got to tell you, uh, we'll go on. They're eating cheese. This is going to be good. Yeah. I'm checking to see what requests I have for this. They're the sitting on the lounge together. Looking at the laptop. Oh, isn't that sweet? Checking her fart list. This guy wants me to fart on a strawberry banana flavored lollipop and then send that out to him. <laughs> oh my fucking God. Yeah. She can charge up. Listen to this. Holy shit. Up to $175 per fart. $175 a fart. What? I'm so telling the bride later, listen. Jesus. I'm not, I'm not farting. I'm giving you free content. Sorry, I'm trying to find a website here so I can order. <laughs> Imagine that. Do, will she do fart? This is great. You get sacked from a job, right? And then yeah. what you do is you get in touch with $175 a fart. Right, and you just like make up a list. Like we'll get her to like, you know, pureed salmon with mozzarella. Oh. And, 
couple of things like Asparagus. that. Asparagus. Yeah, drop drop a sack bomb on uh, <laughs> the old boss. Jeez, that's a good idea. This is why you listen to us. This you is why you those, listen to us, because we've got all the great ideas. Yeah, those sealed envelopes and get her to just drop a big, like, Big fart in there. And do you know send what I mean? It to the boss. And if she's not, a glitter bomb. Yeah, yeah, exactly right. But then do you reckon she does farter greens? Like, you know, she could. You just turn up at your place. No, no, knock on the door and go, hi, I've got a, 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 an, a gram for you. Oh, really? What is it? It's a fu- and they're just dump and nasty. <laughs> right there. And if they <laughs> won't. She lights a match afterwards. And if they don't answer the door. You can just walk around the side <laughs> of the house the, into the air conditioning in. Through the mail slot. Yeah, oh, it, it opened the mail slot too. <laughs> 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 like that. Keep going. Candy, you're in the upload game. three days a week, and I also have little daily fart clips. <laughs> little garden fart? That's for you. I advertise my fart videos on Twitter, on Instagram, on Reddit. <laughs> Ooh. I think the strangest request that I've gotten is to fart on those little miniatures that you see like in the train building sets. I just got a custom video order in for somebody for me to fart in my famous TikTok leggings. So I have quite the workload today. I film all of my fart videos by myself. I set up the lighting, the camera, the mic, everything by myself. This is crucial for capturing all those high notes. She's got one of those blue microphones, similar to the one that you've got there, right? Snowball. Um, It's Similar to that one, but it's a it's a black one. A lot of podcasters and streamers doing games use those mics. Yeah, but, but she does all the makeup. She gets all done up, all that kind of thing in semi sexy shit. And Blue then- notes. Mm. Right now, I have on what I like to call the TikTok leggings. I hear the sound quality is amazing. My farts get so loud. Sometimes I'll blow out the mic. Get ready for this one. I think what makes my fart videos. <laughs> Fuck. Wow. <laughs> but, like, the camera gets right down into it. Like, I know. It's like all you see is ass, and then the audio washes over you like Jesus. a silent but deadly. Like, and oh. a- has she followed through? Like, <laughs> I, I wonder if someone's asked her to. I work, hey, Probably in you, Germany. Yeah, well, in Brazil, Germany, Japan, you name it. There's the three of them there, but, like, she's an okay-looking chick. Like, she's got to be shunned in a community, right? I reckon. Do you reckon she told her family? I, if she hasn't well, told how'd, a- how'd, how'd you buy that new Mercedes? Oh, well, I fart for lonely men on the winter and the internet. Oh, my God. Oh, let's get this over. There's only 30 <laughs> seconds left. Is that I am genuinely enjoying myself farting. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. <laughs> The number one thing I enjoy about my job is the people I make videos for. They absolutely are some of the kindest, most wonderful people I've ever met. They're all so fucking weird! <laughs> That's what they are! Jesus! They're living in Unabomber style My goal is to be known shacks. worldwide as the fart queen and to hopefully retire but still fart every single day. What the... What are you... <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I'll take it back. I'll take and it back. This most wonderful people I've ever met. This is my end goal. In the video, is check this out, Burbalites. And to hopefully retire, but still fart every single day. <laughs> <laughs> she's got some tone. Wow. Like, she's playing the lead oboe in the orchestra there. Like, <laughs> oh my God. Where did you find that from? <laughs> Like I know that the, I know that in this podcast that we say, hey, we're going to find the, the the shit from the internet nonsense. I get it, right? But where did you find that? Where did you? What what dark web are you looking at for all that shit? <laughs> I think it was cracked dot com. Cracked dot com. Right. Yeah, yeah. Because rotten dot rotten dot com doesn't exist anymore, does it? No. We had twenty no. odd good years of looking at uh looking at corpses. Egypt. Yeah. Yeah. But, right. um, look, I, I I thought she needed to be profiled by us. Yeah. She's the kind of thing that we really, really do get into. Yeah. Uh maybe not buying farts. Her name can't be Lush Botanist. That's gotta be a, a But see it's a play on words. Lush I, I get bot. it. I, I get it. I get it. <laughs> I understand. I get it. We're going to another segment right now. All right. Loose talk, even looser opinions. 
the burble. As Renee Gracie. Now, remember her, of course, she used to be in the V8s, uh, racing and all that kind of thing. She was with Simona Di Salvestro and raced in the Bathurst 1000 a couple of times. Didn't do any good. And I'll tell you why, because... Didn't she bin it? She, oh, yeah, binned it, because she's not... 